I'm going to show you how to make this nice, tasty, delicious roux. So just sit back and watch. Hi everyone, you're welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to make a very nice, sweet and tasty snacks. Before I get started, if this is your first time of you passing through my channel, please don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and also don't also forget to press your notification bell for you to see more of my videos. The ingredients I need to use to prepare these particular snacks are cabbage, carrots, hot dog, black pepper, seasonal spice, salt to taste, and ground oil to fry the snacks. So the first thing I need to do is to get a bowl, a clean bowl, and put in the flour. You put the quantity of flour that you need. sugar you know I didn't mention sugar earlier so we are adding sugar to it we are putting enough sugar not depending on how taste you want it then we are going to add a pinch of salt you can see the salt very little so you sprinkle it then you mix all together make sure you mix it very well the sugar the salt we mix with the flour before adding water to it so after mixing all together pour in your water don't allow the water to be too much and you mix with your hands make sure you mix it very well Get your pan on the fire and uh, allow it to heat a little before you put the floor you just miss. You'll be putting it gradually. You'll see the process. So now you cut a little of that floor and you rub it on the pan. Make sure you do it gradually. you are watching it so that once it, it dried up a bit you are going to put it uh, remove it and another thing is that you are going to make the, the floor that i put in the pan now you make it thicker not light so now it's a bit dry so you get if you know you cannot use your hand you can use something like plastic spoon or like this to try and pull it off so you can see now it's see how to get this seat so this is how you are going to do all of them see you finish the floor that you just missed so this is it the, the, the ones that we missed just now that we put on the fire you can see so this is how you are going to do, do them till you get 
get everything done. So the next thing is to get her carrots and wash and slice them. So now you get a bowl that there is water put in the carrot. Make sure you wash the carrot very well because of that. So after washing the carrot, the next thing I will need to scrape it. You can see how it is the body. So I will need to scrape the carrot before I grate it. So now I've peeled off the cabbage. The cabbage I showed you earlier. I like peeling my cabbage like this so that in case there is any uh, worm or anything inside, when I rinse it, it will easily go off. So the next thing is for me to wash them. So now I'm going to place them inside this water. Rinse it very well. So after that, I will slice the, the cabbage. So now the carrot has been sliced. You can see, see it, how it looks for the carrot and also the cabbage. I already sliced them. So the next thing I need to do is to get uh, the hot dog. I need to get the hot dog and slice them also but before i do that i will need to fr i will need to fry the auto a bit so right now i placed uh, a little granola here on this fry pan you can see it because i need to fry the hot dog a little before slicing them so now i'm going to put in the hot dog So now you can see the color has changed. So I need to remove it now so that I can slice the hot dog. So now the hot dog has been sliced. For the hot dog, it depends on how you want it. it. Depends on the shape you want it. If you want to create it, you can go ahead and do that. But I prefer slicing my like this, especially when I want to use it for this room. So right now we're going to place our pan on the fire and get our cabbage and the carrots fried so i'm going to add a little ground oil just a little to the pan to fry the vegetable that the carrot and cabbage so now you pour in your cabbage sorry uh, the carrots then the cabbage this is the cabbage i'm frying then you have your black, your black pepper, so you just sprinkle it around. And while you are doing all these things, putting the spice, you make sure you reduce the heat of the fire. Because you know the, cab, uh, the carrots and the cabbage does not really need too much cooking before removing it. So you just reduce it to the lowest. This is your salt, see a pinch of salt. So you sprinkle it around the cabbage. This is your seasonal spice, so you also sprinkle it around. So after that, you mix all together. Make sure you mix it very well. So after mixing everything together, you will leave it for like two minutes. This time around, just increase the, your heat a little and leave it for two minutes before removing it. So right now, um, vegetable is ready. So right now, I'm going to get a shopping board and place in the fruit flour we missed earlier. Because we are going to put in the vegetable. And we also need a flour. I mixed flour with water to get this uh, liquid because we need it to, to perfect our roll that I want it to. So, right now, I'm going to place in the cabbage. Hot dog 
fried earlier, we're going to add to it. So after placing it, so I'm going to roll it. It's so easy to roll. So when you get to this, this stage, you need to leave space so that if that uh, uh, flower you missed earlier, you place it, you rub it by the side here.